welcome to this very special series legends and pressure how do legends deal with extreme pressure pulela gopichand has done that as a player pulela gopichand has done that multiple times as coach as the indian team this you know gets ready to play the semi final against new zealand in mumbai we are sort of speaking to the best indian sport has to offer and asking this question how do we deal with extreme pressure 2019 we lost against the same opponent gopi you've been there done that in your sport many times that's the question how do athletes deal with extreme pressure well i think uh, we have to accept that there is a lot of pressure at the back of our minds whatever we say it's okay it's another game well we know that it's not an other game the only thing we can do as as athletes is to keep the routine going and that makes it very very uh, important for us to kind of stick to that so where there is pressure there are people who are going to talk and i just give you one example of how we did it when uh, you were there at rio so basically we would just do everything the same way and then the players were protected to ensure sindhu was protected to ensure that there's no outsider coming and talking to her a simple thing like we are praying for you the whole country wants you to win it actually makes it like a burden to carry which is not necessary at that moment of time so i think stick to routine do the things know and trust your preparation trust your instincts don't be too safe that's an important aspect i think you have to play and take the risks you have to be preparation should be 100% effort on that day should be a lot more playful you should be like 70 80% there you should be not stiff to take the pressure or the fear of stiffness or the over tightness of actually wanting to win it's important that you're playful you're able to be risky you're able to kind of take those chances which are important and be brave you know when when you're mentioning these things and 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 let me divide this into two parts uh, in my next 5 minutes one you've mentioned the players what about the coach you've been in that position yourself when you sit at the back of the court you're watching the action when rahul dravid sits there for him also massive two matches coming up semi final final as a, as the coach of india perhaps not the greatest record yet so for rahul also it matters a great deal if you place yourself in that coach's position which you are and you sort of been there for many titles what should what is your take i mean how does how does a coach who is a legend in himself your your own case rahul dravid for this cricket team how does a coach approach this well i think it's a very important that whatever pressure you have you have but it should not transfer as pressure to the players i think it's very important that your body language your demeanor your communication should ensure that there is calmness there is total support and whatever is the planning you should do should be emphatic it should be very decisive in the decision making and no no uh, thing to take for chance in the sense if it has to be that you have to bowl on the offside this cricketing example or you have to bowl a bouncer you have to do it it's like you, you i wouldn't really be comfortable saying that you do what you want or you kind of uh, you can play the this or that i think it's, it needs to be a very clear instruction so that the players who are doubtful have decisions taken um, for them and they're following it uh final question you know in in the case of sindhu or even in the case of satvik chirag in the case of sindhu several times she's lost against maybe a carolina mari or uh, a ties doing in the case of satvik chirag till recently several times against chia and uh, so or for that matter the indonesian pair when you are coaching in such a game to the past matter what do you tell your your students uh, uh, india has lost to new zealand in 2019 in the world test championship final in 21 do these things matter at all when you go into a big semi final a fresh game well um maybe it does from the player mind but as as a coach you're going out there and basically telling what their best points are reiterating what their preparations have been and take this as a fresh match 
and and i think it's very important that you cut off what is there from the past and talk about what you've done well to get here or how you've prepared well to be here and how you deserve to be the next team going forward i think that's all it matters i think the past records um, more for statisticians and post mortem rather than really for any effect on the match got it i know you've got to take your flight to japan and uh, all the very best uh, for your travels to satvik and chirag to pronoy who's making a comeback we will all sort of follow you as we do on rave sports but for the moment thank you very very much for your time uh, because this is a match of extreme pressure for all of india's cricket fans and the players so thank you for your thank you for your contributions i hope every athlete who listens to you and the coaches who listen to you will benefit from this conversation thank you very much thank you boya thank you so much thanks a lot